In this tutorial, we'll cover some specific tools within Rematch Color in Premiere Pro. Rematch Color works with images of different sizes and should be related in some way, like the same location at different times. This complements our other tutorials about other features of Rematch that work the same in all applications. So watch our other tutorials about overall features and if you're using Premiere Pro, check out a few tips that are specific to use in Premiere Pro. Let's get started. Now let's say we want to match color to another view of this scene. Here are the two views. What we have here is some HD footage we want to match to some 4K footage shot with another camera. So I put it on the track below the HD footage and we can start by adding rematch color to our HD footage. We go to the effect controls and select video one as our track to get color from. We can choose a color space and I picked RGB. It didn't get us as close as I think we could get, so we're going to try a few more tools. Since the first frame of the 4K footage is the closest camera angle to our HD shot, we may just want to match to that frame so that they're the same angle. The way we do that is by using frame to match. We can choose match to still one over here in the still settings. I'm going to choose store still one time. Now I choose frame zero because that's the first frame, but you can choose any frame you want to match. If the color still doesn't match with one of the transfer methods, we can use the windowing features. This way, only the pixels within the window will be taken into account. The way we do this is we select Window Match. In Premiere, to see the handles to change the rectangle, you have to select the actual name of the effect in the Effects Control. We check Display Window Frame and choose Draw Over Target. Then we can take the top point and move it down to exclude some of the sky and bring the bottom up to exclude some of the road. We're trying to match what the reference looks like so they are matching similar looking shots for a better result. We can select Draw Over Source. This defines the region that we're matching to or getting the color from. Also notice when you go to draw over source to get color from that it displays the entire image even though we're working on an HD project. We don't need to redefine the boundaries of this window because we're going to use the whole image to match to now that we have already redefined the boundaries of our target image to match the source. Now we can reset it back to draw over target, the image that we're applying the change to. So in one case, there's a lot more image with a lot of trees and less sky and road. So the windows allow us to set a comparison base that's a lot more related, making the color match more accurate. If I turn the window match on and off, you can see the difference. Now we would just render our result. So this is how to use the window feature for rematch color in Premiere Pro. If you need specific definitions for menu items that were not covered here, please refer to the user documentation.